got out here to some structural area. Sun is coming up. See some schoolies working. So I'm going to start off with a little schoolie catch, hopefully. And then I'm going to switch over to doing a little tog fishing. I used to just use some Asian crabs and see what's around. Both the sea bass and taw tog season is open right now. So I'm going to see if I can get one. Oh, these guys. So I think they're here. I just got picked off pretty quick. Yeah, it's a very, very small fish. Maybe not. I think it's a tog. Foul hook porgy. Didn't, I wanted to try to release, release him, but I think I hit him in the gill plate or something. So this guy will come back with me. Ton of them down there though. The Robin. <laughs> Too small. Nope. Too small. There we go. The porgy bag. Nice, there's the dog. Not gonna keep, but I'm f but that's what we're here for. Pretty slimy little guys. That's what we're here for. Tatog on Asian crab. I, I'm not even gonna bother measuring this. I know he's not big enough. I think it's probably like 12 inches, if I had to guess. Still a cool catch. I'm glad I got one. All right, buddy. I'll see you later. Another tog. Nice. Really little one, though. Well, at least we're getting them, you know, nice hook sets, you know, it's a tough day, but we're doing what we can here. Later, buddy. We got our keeper. There we go. Tatog for lunch. Woo! <laughs> right, we're gonna measure this guy down here because I don't want him to flop out. Sixteen and a half. Perfect. Nice. Perfect. No, seventeen. Seventeen. 
All right, we're having tog. Ooh, it's getting hot out here. I'm just dipping my feet for a second and cleaning up the kayak, but probably gonna head in. I think I'm gonna see you guys at the, the dinner table. All right, it's many hours later, but I'm back. Got a friend in town. So before I left, I filleted the tautog, which looks slamming. And I got a, some porgies here. I'm just gonna throw the porgies on there, cook them whole, and then do the tautog. Some of the tautog I left the skin on, and then some of it I filleted. So a little bit of half shell and a little bit of just filet for a sandwich. So yeah, let's get it on the grill. Got our porgies all prepped and our tautog. It's a lot of meat for one fish. A lot of clean meat. Meat looks really nice for the tautog. So let's get this on the grill. I'm gonna start with the porgies. New grill, very fancy, right? Second day using it. Put the porgy on that side. Got some olive oil on the tau taug. All right, friends, I think we're ready. Let's see what we're dealing with. This Weber is red hot. Pretty good, right? I think the tog is definitely done. All right, well, the porgy needs a little bit longer. I got this nice sandwich put together with the filet, the Topo Chico, and let's taste test this filet. Looks pretty slamming. All right, here we go, taste test. Slamming. That's the best one in the sound. That's the one. You want to catch any fish in the sound, this is the one. Tastes like delicious, better than chicken. So good. Slamming. Oh, it's like addicting. It's so good. All right, y'all. Well, I'm gonna eat this sandwich for dinner. Thank you for joining me on another episode. Still got these porgies cooking over here, but they're almost done. And uh, I'm gonna enjoy dinner. Thank you for watching as always. I appreciate everyone that watches the channel. I'll catch y'all soon.